So this is what my room looks like now. Hey guys, it's Hannah and I'm really excited for today's video. Today I'm finally going to be redoing my room. I've been wanting to do this for the longest time and I just never got myself off my butt to actually go get stuff and actually get myself to start doing things to change it up and I guess I'm using this video as an incentive to actually do that. I don't think my room is especially bad, but I think it's just outdated for the style that I'm into. Like this live, love, laugh thing is something I'm definitely not into anymore. I'm not sure if I like the color of this. I'm not gonna be buying new furniture in this video. It's more just like me redecorating my room and getting new stuff to um, make it more my style. I'm so excited to finally get this started. Holy crap! But before we get into this, I have to give you guys a before because I want you guys to see the difference between the before and after. Plus, I want you guys to get an idea of what my room looks like at the moment. So without a doubt, the first thing I gotta do is go shopping and get a couple things. So, let's go do that. On the legs right now, don't judge me. What? <laughs> Basically, I wanna see if I can find like a pillow of some sort. I need to get some frames. Then I um, also need to get a couple of like little decor pieces and some boxes to put like organizational stuff in. I'm thinking something like this might be cute. Oh my god, this is perfect. This is so nice to organize my stuff. It's like we're not getting that $30. Okay, so I'm gonna start the redoing with my desk area. There's just a bunch of stuff that I wanna get rid of. And when I was at Ikea, I got myself this little, is that a shelf unit? Kind of. I always have just like a bunch of schoolwork sitting on the side here. And I thought it would be helpful to be able to put my schoolwork in there. This really doesn't seem that difficult. Like if you look at the pictures, you can kind of like infer how everything goes. Okay, I built that in like 20 minutes, so I'm probably gonna just keep that here and now I'm gonna fill it with a couple of decorations up here and then I can use these two for storage space. I'm stealing this candle from my sister. When you working hard and your money start spend, I got model bitches wanna getting rid of these things and when we were replacing them with these ones just because I feel like I like these a lot better. I don't think this is okay. Oh my god. And we are done. Can we talk about how clean this is? I really don't have very many decorations at the moment, so I'll probably end up picking a couple of things and putting them over here. But drawers are like completely empty at this point. Since we're on a roll now and into it, next up we're gonna tackle my closet. This is so nasty. I really need to sort out old school stuff and decide what I want to keep and what I don't want to because I definitely don't want to throw all of it away, but I just have way too much. I don't need it. This is the keep pile and this is the donate pile. I can't even tell if I'm making progress anymore. And I'm done. Took everything out of here, organized all my schoolwork into all of these folders. So this is basically my life's worth of schoolwork from grade two onwards. I don't have anything from grade one, I don't know why. Then these are the books I decided to keep. And this area is organized. I feel so accomplished. Hello again. It's two days later and today I'm gonna be working on my dresser area. I need to take these down and I stuck them on with double-sided tape so I gotta remove this stuff off my walls. I watched a tutorial and I'm really hoping that it works. Ew, this is so dusty. And them drawers come in handy. 
Last name Savage, bitch, but no, I'm not Randy. Hit her with no condom, had to make her eat up. This area turned out pretty good. You can barely see anything, so I'm pretty happy with that. I just found out that we have a handyman coming over tomorrow, and he might be able to paint over some scars and like just different scratches that I have on the wall. So I'm actually gonna take down this thing today as well because that's stuck on with double sided tape too. So now that I have all my stuff out, that'll just be more practical. Wow, there's not a single mark on the wall. I'm so happy. In terms of what I'm gonna put up here, I got this pole at Ikea. It's the Fintorp one, and it basically is just a black pole with like attachments that come with it. So I'm gonna pin that up above here, and then I got these plants that I'm gonna hang from it. She can say in her voice and her way that she like me. The pole is up, but I can't hang these up quite yet just because I need to wait for the tape to harden a little bit. So I'm gonna wait like two to three-ish hours. And while I'm waiting, I'm gonna do this right here. So I'm gonna sort through it and try to organize it as best as I can because a lot of the stuff is stuff that I just don't use anymore. I'm gonna go through this and try and decorate it and make it look as nice as possible. Smile with her belt, with her hands, with her money. I am the thesis of her prayer. Yay. And this is the final result. As you can tell, I didn't really add any more decorations. I'm just kind of using this as practical reasons, just to store some stuff, make it easy to access. I'm going through drawers now because these drawers were just a mess. That is so much better. Ooh, okay. Also next to my dresser, I'm gonna put this plant right here that we got gifted by a friend that's moving. That is this area of my room done. It's a couple days later and today we are tackling my bathroom and we're going to do my bed area. My bathroom really just needs a little bit of a cleanup in terms of like organization right here and in here because we just have a bunch of stuff that I don't use. So I'm gonna exchange these real quick. Oh my God, that's so much better. Hell yeah. Since I always just kind of have stuff laying here, I got myself this little organizational thing from Ikea as well. So let's get to organizing and going through everything. I'm pessimistic on Monday if I had tweaked and missed you. You look so good with the hat on, had to match with the shoe. Came and dressed in the satin, I came and sat in your pew. I come to Christmas for dinner. Okay, so that is all of this organized. It looks so much better and it's actually stuff that I use. Oh my god, I completely forgot about this guy when I was doing my desk. There we go, that's Tim for you guys. And to finish it off, nice new soap. And that is the bathroom done. These containers are probably the most useful purchase I've made throughout this entire video. For my bed area, I'm gonna start off with my bedside table because once again, it's just a little messy looking. Ew. Much better. Okay, there we go, we have some white. Obviously this looks super bland. So, for this corner right here, what I've decided to do is I'm gonna put up a couple frames. I have these four different frames and I'm gonna decide how I wanna hang them up in the corner over here. And then, on Pinterest, I've been looking through different like patterns and things that I could print out. I don't know for sure which ones I want to do, but I definitely like at least one of these two. And then maybe I'll look around and see if I can find anything else that I like. Also, just need to say that this is really, really satisfying to do. <gasps> Let's put them in. Okay. Looks like on this side. Of I'm actually really happy with this. It could be a little more colorful, but the problem is if I added more color, I feel like it would just look messy. So I'm actually really happy with this. The biggest thing in my room that I haven't changed yet is this part. And not going to lie, I'm still a fan of it. I do want to switch it up though. And what I think I'm going to do instead is I'm going to hang up this map. 
I found this in my dad's office, so hopefully he doesn't need this for anything because it was just folded up in one of the drawers. Now, let's hang up the mat. I left a little bit of space to the left of the map because the final thing that I'm going to be adding to my room is a cork board. Perfect. And that is actually going to wrap it up for everything that I'm doing to my room. So, time for the final overview. So this is what my room looks like now. That is going to be it for this entire video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it and this gave you guys some ideas for things that maybe you'd like to do to your room or ways to organize because obviously a large part of this was also throwing away a bunch of stuff that I don't need anymore and cleaning out my entire room. Didn't I Holy crap, I've never been so scared in my life. I'm gonna have to fix that. There's also other things I would have wanted to change like maybe getting new curtains because I'm not a huge fan of the purple and getting more throw pillows for my bed, that type of thing. But in all honesty, I think that's going to take a couple months and I'm never going to be truly content with my room. There's always going to be something small that I want to change. If you liked the video, obviously give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below if you're not yet subscribed. I love you all to the moon and back and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! I am going to go eat some Subway. Hey.